Hey guys, Cardi your mom here. Uh, today I'm gonna show you another episode of the ski resort that we are building. Um, if you haven't saw the first episode, the first episode I showed you this log cabin and the little secret hidden room that uh, that we built well, along with uh, the beginning of our ski lift here. Uh, today I'm gonna show you uh, the lodge. Um, my oldest son, Hef0116, began to build the log cabin inside of the mountain. Um, we have yet to put the secret hidden room in there, but uh, I did manage to finish the lodge. Uh, could have made the roof a little bit better, I think. But uh, I do have, if you haven't, if you haven't watched, I do have the working bar uh, or kitchen inside of the lodge. So I'm going to go ahead and show you the lodge today. Uh, as you can see, there's two entrances. One goes right to the bar or kitchen, kitchen area. Second one goes into like a little dining, eating area. You know, got a couple little uh, item frames on the wall here. Uh, just this, you know, add a little bit of decoration. Got the fire pit uh, or fireplace or whatever. Uh, if you do notice that I do have like a pattern on the floor. Uh, there is a secret hidden room in this floor, and I will show you how to do that in a couple minutes. But uh, let me go ahead and show you. Uh, if you mount two jukeboxes on top of each other, they kind of look like speakers, uh, which is what we were going for. Naturally, we got our music and stuff inside the box here. Uh, as you can see, I've incorporated the working bar or kitchen into our little bar area. So. Uh, you know, naturally, a couple of furnaces, uh, crafting table, you know, chest. Uh, and here's our fridge. You get some mutton out of this one, uh, steak out of that one. Uh, that's pretty basic, easy stuff. Like a, you know. And here's our uh, here's our stove, a little uh, stack going at the top. Uh, and you know, naturally, he I told him, <laughs> cried your dad to uh, put whatever he wanted in the chest to come out of the ceiling. So, uh, yeah, he put clownfish. So let's go ahead and hit the button. Oh, there it is. All right. You can't eat the clownfish, but uh, it's, it is what it is. Same thing. Here comes the apple. Got the apple. Can eat the apple. Uh, let's see. He put water in this one. Again, if you, uh, if you haven't watched the episode of how I show you how to make this, uh, go ahead and watch that after you finish this episode. And, uh... Blaring so loud. Um, yeah, so I'll show you how to make this in the shoot. I did that in the other episode too. I don't understand how I keep doing that, but good grief. <laughs> Alright, so uh, yeah, normally this works pretty well. I keep doing that for some reason. I have no idea why. Um, yeah, go ahead and watch that episode, and uh, I'll show you exactly how to do the redstone to have the droppers drop you the stuff out of the ceiling. Um, all right, so let's go into the secret room. All right, uh, the gravel. Uh, to do this type of secret room, you have to use something that falls, with, whether it be gravel or sand. Um, there is a chest room underneath of this block here. So let me show you how we do this. All right, so naturally I got a couple couple levers here. One of these levers work, one doesn't. Uh, but I also have hidden a lever on the outside of the house to drop the first part of it. Uh, if you go around the back side here, hit this lever, you can see the floor opens up. You cannot get down there unless you hit the other lever to pull the, um, the gravel to the, to the side so that way you can get down. Um, as I was doing this, I had a little brain fart. See if you uh, if you notice that one of the gravel pieces is gone. It pops over here. Um, that's a little bit of an issue, but I don't know why I uh, didn't think about it when I was building this, uh, how to do it. Um, but I did figure it out. I'm going to make a little episode of how to do these little hidden rooms. Uh, there it is. Gravel. All right, so naturally this setup that I have here, I have to put that piece of gravel that I get from there back on the step to get back up. So yeah, so it's just a little hidden chest room. Um, as you're down here, you can actually close the close it back up. You cannot close it all the way completely, but you can close it back up. Um, so yeah, 
So, as you can tell, it's pretty extensive redstone uh, to get it up and around. That's this. This is where the switch is to the backside. Uh, a couple little pistons to pull and push the gravel where you want it to go. Um, I do have an easier way to do this. Like I said, I had a little bit of a brain fart, and uh, you know, as I was building it, I wasn't really thinking clearly and uh, messed it up a little bit. So, but other than that, it's pretty cool. So, uh, and it didn't work right. Of course, it didn't work right because I messed it up. <laughs> I think I messed up. Yes, I did. Um, like I said, I had a little bit of an issue with this uh, as I was building it, but I do know how to build this the right, correct way, and I will show you how to make this. I'm going to show you how to make this one and three other ways to get down to the thing, to your secret chest rooms. Look, man, that sucks. I messed it up. So I'm probably gonna have to reshow you that it does work. So I'll cut the I'll cut the video here and show you it does work. Let me just reset it back up. I'll be right back. Okay, I'm back. So uh, yeah, my issue was that uh, the lever downstairs, since it is you close the door behind you, the lever downstairs uh, you have to turn back off uh, before you head back up. That's the issue with it. Um, so here we go again. Let me try it again and show you that it does work. Let's open the floor up. For some reason I can't sprint right now. Alright, so the floor is open. Kind of. Till you hit this lever. And it didn't do it again. So let me hit Okay, so there you go. Alright, so I hit it twice by accident instead of just at one time. And as you can see, this one piece of gravel does pop out to the outside. Um, you just throw that back up. You can, like I said, close this. And it pushes that gravel back out. You pick it up. And you turn this back off. And hop back out. Okay, so the only issue with this one is... That one piece of gravel you have to replace every single time. But uh, other than that, okay, so it's turned back off. You come back up. Hit the lever again. It pushes it over. And then you have to actually go back out and around, depending on where you put your levers. So uh, you can put your levers close together, right next to each other, whatever. Do a sequence again. And then there you go. It's closed up. Uh, and then, again... It works until you just got to make sure you hit that lever downstairs. I'll show you how to do the redstone. Like I said, I found an easier way to do it as I was building this. But, uh, yeah, so pretty cool little setup uh, with a lot of windows and it being rainy and snowy outside that uh, you don't really too many, need too many torches. Uh, as you can see, all my torches wiped off of here. But, uh, yeah, so, you know, like I said, if you, uh, you want to learn how to do the bar go ahead and watch my uh my episode of uh the working bar slash kitchen or kitchen slash bar in minecraft video and uh it'll show you exactly how to do the redstone to you know make this work uh this works great a lot of people like the video and i appreciate that i really appreciate that thanks guys for that uh so yeah you know uh, i got one more episode to show you on that one so far. Um, Grady your daddy made a little, uh, well, not little, but huge snowman. I'm going to turn that into uh, another trap, but I'm going to make it to where you can walk through the mountain somehow, like kind of like a bat cave. Uh, I'll figure that out. But, uh, yeah, so I hope you guys enjoyed it. Um, sorry about the little mix-up, but uh, like I said, look for the... Uh, the redstone tutorials of how to actually do all these uh, hidden room setups. Uh, I'll be putting that out you know, probably in the next couple of days. So I'll, I'll show you like four or five different ways to do hidden rooms. This one actually is more hidden than the other one that I showed you in the last episode. So 
And uh, like I said, hope you guys enjoyed it. So um, like, subscribe, and share if you can. I uh, really appreciate it. Thanks so much.